This is lesson 3.4, example 4 of 5. We have three girls who saw each other at the skating rink today. The first girl skates every two days, the second girl every four days, and the third girl every six days. How long and how many days until they're all there again? So once more, we are finding the least common multiple here. Every time we have one of these problems where it's every so many days, we need to find until how long all three or two converge again. That's least common multiple. So we need to find the least common multiple of two, four, and six. Two, four, and six. We're going to do this using the list method. Two, four, and six. We'll start by listing our factors. We'll start listing the first, uh, let's go five to start with. Two, four, six, eight, ten, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty, six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty. Do we have any common, any common multiples across all three? Well, these two share four, but six doesn't. Six and two share six, but four doesn't. Four and two share eight, but six doesn't. And four and six share 12, but two doesn't either. So what we have to do here is continue going. We're going to have to add more. So I'm going to add a few more over here to two. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. We'll add a few more to four. 24, 28, 32. 36, 40, and 6, 36, uh, 42, 48, 54, and 60. Now we have a bunch more common fact, common multiples. I keep asking about common multiples here. We have 12 and we would have 24. We have 12. <laughs> if I keep going with 2, we would have had 24 as well. But 24 doesn't matter because 12 is smaller anyway. And we want the least common multiple. That is the smallest number. The smallest number. 